There are many battery holders with similar design, which is made for AA and AAA batteries. I choose this for a nice style because it looks different and you can see how many batteries are inside. I managed to fit inside 21 AA and 39 AAA batteries, that's a lot. The batteries are a little bit difficult to get out. After I have took out 3 AA batteries, others stuck inside. If I help with a finger, they fall down. The same thing happened with AAA batteries. I thought maybe the positive terminals get stuck on the Voronoi wall, so I turned all positive terminals against the middle wall. But it still happened. Overall, nice design, but some problems with functionality. This battery holder is for AAA batteries and also AA version, version is available. You need to snap two bars together, but be careful, do not break it like I did. This hinge bar should be designed stronger. It broke maybe because my printer tolerances, which could be off and it didn't fit like it should. Or if you add more infill or walls, it goes stronger, but the filament amount also increased. Some under extrusion also happened and made it weaker. So your printer would be better. One broke, but other one seems to be okay. It fits 20 triple A's and double A version also 20. Two parts design, which can fit up to 8 double A batteries. Don't forget to use supports when printing tray. I needed to sand the tray a little bit to get smooth sliding and it's easier to open it. Before slicing the model, upscale it to 2540% or you get this little box for something but not 18650 batteries. Nice solid design, the upper green filament looks nice and the print quality is good. It can fit up to 8 batteries and it has slidable lead. Lead has nice grips for your fingers. It seems like the battery is pushing out a little bit. So there can be two things, this 18650 battery is bigger than it's designed for or this box is too small, it's usable as it is or you can upscale it to fit nicely. Don't have 3D printer, but you need something to 3D print, just go type in pcbway.com and start ordering your stuff. There are many different types of 3D printing you can choose from, different materials. PCBWay also makes custom PCBs. They provide CNC milling service, sheet metal fabrication and injection molding. This is very easy. Upload your file. Select units. Material. Color. You can choose different surface finish. If you like prototyping and making cool staff, this is good place to order your custom parts. First time I printed it some parts broke during the print and I stopped it. Some parts are narrow and long which can break easily. Second time with same settings it didn't break. It is interesting design, something different than others. It's made for 8 AAA batteries. Top and bottom are the same so you can use it both way. When you turn it, next slot opens. Print in place design, when the holder is full, you need to turn opening between two slots, because otherwise batteries can fall out. Yeah. 
You can use black marker to add some details, but marker can easily came off and spread. You need to cut off the supports, which are added to the model. If you don't do it, you can't attach white side parts. If you cut off the supports, be careful of small pieces lying there everywhere. Assembly is easy and it don't use much time. No need for any screws, springs or glue. Holds for AAA batteries, maybe less practical than others, but points for the cool design. Two part design prints very easy, I use supports for the main part, but it should print without supports also. It can hold 5 different battery types, 2 LR44s, 1 9V, 1 12 AAAs and 12 AA's. It's a nice test of battery holder which can hold many batteries. It has compact design but it makes hard to get out smaller batteries, no room for fingers. Case for 4 AAA batteries, it seems to be designed for traveling, fits nicely into the pocket or bag, keeps them together, less chance to lose them, screw on cap, threads are good, batteries fits nicely, no problems with it. Next battery holder case is for LR44 batteries, it can hold up to 6, two parts fits together with thread. LR44s I don't use very often, mostly for kids books. Batteries fits nicely and not falling out, threads are with good tolerances and cap screws are smoothly. Next one is print in place battery box for 10CR2032 batteries, mostly used in remotes. At first, hinge are a little bit fused together, so you need to break them loose carefully. Simple and nice box, print in place design makes it even better. Battery switch great and box closes and opens fine. Double case for double A and triple uh, A batteries, simple design, looks good and works good. Caps are held in place nicely and there are grips that makes opening easier. It's good to use if you are traveling and you want to take two extra batteries with you. To join two parts together, you need to need piece of filament. I heated one end and made it bigger, pushed the filament through the hinge, then I cut it the right length and did the same thing to get the end bigger. This box uses inserts to hold different batteries and also other useful things. First one is for 
triple A batteries which can hold 8. Triple A batteries fit nicely, if you insert them fit, you could have problem with leveling. Elephant foot effect, level the bed and try again. Double A battery insert fit 6. Double A batteries fit in the insert and the lid closes with any problems. Insert for 2 9 volt batteries. Insert for ST or micro ST. Some inserts can put inside on the bottom and others on the top, so you can fit in two at once. You can also use it to store your printer nozzle, but if you flip the box, all nozzles are moved out of place. All in one box is made to hold three different types of batteries 18, 650s, triple A's, and double A's. You can also remove battery inserts and use this case to hold anything you want. This model was awarded first place in Printables Battery Box Contest. You can change the inlets for the different size batteries. These boxes fit 12 AA and 24 AAA batteries. I had problems with the bed adhesion, then I used prim and nozzle got clogged, so I tried one more time with prim and mass to print it. Adhesion problems was caused by dirty bed sheet, when I cleaned it properly I got it much better, so keep your bed clean. This battery holder has this nice design, you need to assemble 4 parts, you don't need any screws or glue. It can hold up to 13 AA batteries. It's very easy to get the batteries out and all moves smoothly, no batteries getting stuck. I like the design, it works and looks good, easy assembly and you don't need much filament to make it. Open cap, date battery is in, close cap, when container is full, unscrew the upper part and empty the container, it should not be emptied into the trash bin. 